Hey guys, Mindy, how to Friday, and we're doing a series, remember, so this is part two of shifting your identity. So part one recap was four steps in stepping back. So go watch that video, because today we're on the next part, which is letting go. And so what might you get to let go of in order for the last question in stepping back to not be a problem. So the last question in stepping back was, is there any part of you that objects to showing up this way? And so if the answer to that is yes, then what might you get to let go of in order for that to not be a problem anymore? So really get curious, like tune in, what do I get to let go of in order for that to not be a problem, in order for me to not object? What, what do I get to be willing to change? What belief, what action, what thought, what habit, right? Get curious about that. And then, and we just have two steps today. The other step in letting go is if you let go, what opens up for you? What freaking magic is available for you? What expansion? What new perspective? What do you get to see? What do you get to have in your life if you let go of what you're deeming to be a problem that's keeping you from shifting your identity? We are going to be under two minutes and 22 seconds. Uh, does anybody know Chuck Woolery? For our How To Friday today. So how to shift your identity Part two, letting go. Let me know. Where are you in this process? Are you ready to just chat? Because just link up. Let's chat.